Please encourage me to create new videos. Please like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. In this video we are going to look at factory method design pattern. The factory method pattern provides a way to create different objects without specifying the exact class of object that will be created. Classes designed with the factory method pattern can produce different objects, all of which share a common type. This common type is typically an interface or an abstract class. Classes designed with the factory method pattern include a factory method that manages the object creation process. This method contains the logic required to determine and return the appropriate object when requested by the client application. For example, Imagine a DB connection factory class designed with the factory method pattern that provide connections to different databases like Oracle, PostgreSQL and MySQL. Instead of application knowing how to create these connections, it asks the DB connection factory class to give it the right connection. The factory method in DB connection factory determines which type of connection to create and return it to the application. Benefits of factory method design pattern are loose coupling. In classes designed with the factory method pattern, new type of objects can be added or object creation logic can be modified without needing to change the application code that calls the factory method. Below is the pictorial diagram of DB connection factory method that return various objects like Oracle, PostgreSQL and MySQL database connection objects. In the step 1 of this pictorial diagram, you can see we are having the interface Database Connection Interface This interface is implemented by three classes MySQL Connection, Oracle Connection and PostgreSQL Connection Database Connection is the common interface for all the above class objects. In the step 2 of this pictorial diagram we have DB Connection Factory Interface This DB Connection Factory Interface is implemented by DB Connection Factory IMPL class. This DB Connection Factory IMPL class contains factory method that based on selection logic returns object of MySQL connection, Oracle connection and PostgreSQL connection. The client application code requests object through this factory method. This point is very important. When a factory method returns multiple types of objects, the return type must be the common type that all those objects share which is database connection interface for our example. This is just a code preview of factory method pattern. I will explain in more detail in the upcoming part of this video. High level steps for implementing factory method design pattern are Step 1. Create the database connection interface which is the common interface for all database connections. Important point to note is the return type for factory method is database connection interface which we will see in later steps. Step 2 is create the concrete classes that implement database connection interface. The first class is MySQL connection class that implements database connection interface. 
The second class is Oracle Connection class that implements database connection interface. The third class is PostgreSQL Connection class that implements database connection interface. Step 3 is Define a DB connection factory interface with a create connection method that returns a database connection interface for different database types. Step 4 is Implement DB connection factory IMPL class by implementing the DB connection factory interface with a create connection method using a switch case to return specific database connections based on the provided DB type. Step 5 is in factory method demo. We use factory method to obtain database connection objects for Oracle, PostgreSQL, and MySQL databases, demonstrating how different objects can be created with a common return type. In this line, we are creating a factory instance using the DB connection factory implementation which we have created in step 4. In this line we use the factory method that is create connection method to create an oracle connection class object. Two important points to note here are just check the return type which is database connection interface which is the common interface for all database connection objects. Create connection method is a factory method that contains switch case logic to return the appropriate object like Oracle, Postgres and MySQL connection objects. In this line we call the connection method of Oracle connection class by using the connection object of Oracle connection class obtained from the factory method. In this line we use the factory method that is create connection method to create PostgreSQL connection class object. In this we call the connect method of PostgreSQL connection class by using the object of PostgreSQL connection class obtained from the factory method. In this line we use the factory method that is create connection method to create a MySQL connection class object. In this we call the connect method of MySQL connection class by using the object of MySQL connection class obtained from the factory method. I have already explained each piece of code step by step. Now as we run the example, you can see from the console output that Oracle connection, PostgreSQL connection and MySQL connection objects are working as expected, each calling their respective connect methods. For better understanding, please download the source code from GitHub repository. I have provided the link in the description section of this video. Please encourage me to create new videos. Please like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.